Hey there, my name is Michael Hunter, co-founder of Spiffy. Thanks so much for checking out this video. I want to give you a quick overview of our active campaign integration uh, because it's very, very powerful and it's easy to just kind of gloss over it and not really understand what it's all about. Uh, but Spiffy is actually the only tool on the market when it comes to checkout pages that actually leverages Active Campaign's deep data integration. Now, what does that mean? So, without Spiffy, this e commerce tab here is usually not there. And so, when somebody checks out through a Spiffy checkout page, it actually populates the contact record with order data. So, we actually send order data over to Active Campaign, and that unlocks a whole feature set of power in Active Campaign that you didn't even know existed. So, here you have lifetime value of a customer. Active Campaign calls that total revenue. You can see how many total orders, how many products were purchased. You can see each uh, order record here and the, all the items that were in that order. Um, and then if I come back over here in recent activities, you can see in this timeline of all, all of the purchases that these customers made through Spiffy. And I can actually click on this order ID and it takes me right to that order record within Spiffy where I can see uh, you know, their billing address, I can see the the different items that were ordered. I can refund individual items just by clicking on that little settings uh, icon and then hitting refund, or I can refund the entire order. I can also view this order right in Stripe. So this integration with Active Campaign or the deep data integration is going to make it make things a lot more efficient for your support team for you to kind of track down uh, when people's payments were going through, and so you're not having to go and search for different things in multiple systems. Uh, it's all integrated and with a few different clicks you can get right to that transaction right in Stripe or uh, you know make it easy to issue refunds and stuff within Spiffy so again uh, going back to what I was saying this information is awesome just having it on the contact record but it also opens up a whole new feature set with an active campaign when it comes to uh, filtering segmenting and searching your database based off of advanced uh, e-commerce data so here, I can now filter, segment, search, trigger automations all based off of e-commerce data. Things like total revenue, last order date. So maybe you want to issue a customer appreciation campaign. Uh, you know, it's not some sort of promotion or offer just to your customers who have spent more than two thousand dollars with you, or or whatever that threshold is. Uh, you can, based off of total revenue, uh, is greater than. $2,000, now you could segment, search, trigger a campaign. Uh, last order date is a huge one. Uh, so if you're looking at your data and you can see that, hey, shoot, if somebody doesn't come back and buy from us after 180 days, they tend to not come back. So you can uh, look at your data, see when your uh, big drop off is from repeat customers, and you can actually issue a, a re engagement campaign at 150 days and then do whatever it takes to get that customer back because as you're looking at your data, it just shows that you know people are dropping off at that point. So again, there's a lot of cool things that you can do. I just highlighted two of them, which would be the most popular ones, total revenue, last order date, but there's a whole slew of different options that you can get creative with uh, to use order data and sales data to segment, trigger, and get help get the right message in front of the right person. One other cool little quick thing under the email reports, uh, there's this little tab here that says revenue. So the only way that this tab works to track revenue is if you have a deep data integration. So you can actually track the ROI back to a specific email, uh, the last email that they opened. This typically works best when you are sending out a series of sales emails or you're in sort, some sort of promotion. You can actually track the performance of each individual email. So whatever email they clicked on last uh, before they made the sale, the ROI and the revenue is going to be uh, attributed back to the last email that they opened. Uh, so you can see here when you hover over it just says revenue generated by this campaign in the seven days after it was sent. So again, whatever last email was opened uh, you know, prior to that purchase is going to get that attribution. So uh, again, uh, super, super cool stuff. I'm just scratching the surface of this, but there's a lot of awesome things that you can do with the deep data integration. You are not leveraging the full power of active campaign if you do not have a deep data integration and if you do not have your sales data in active campaign. So let us know if you have any questions. Reach out to our support team at support at spiffy.co. Again, that's support at spiffy.co. We'd love to see you as a spiffy customer. Uh, give us a shot. You have a 
30-day money-back guarantee. So you can set up your account today and get started with us. Take Spiffy for a test drive for 30 days. Leverage our support team. Ask questions. Let us help you get set up. And if it's not the right fit for you, no harm, no foul. Just let us know within that 30 days and we'll give you your money back. Uh, but I'm confident that you'll be very happy with your choice in using Spiffy. And we're doing a lot of cool things and would love to have you as a customer. So uh, you can register for a demo or reach out to us and I uh, would love to help you get started. Thanks so much for watching this video. Talk to you soon.